I would not be feeding this dog food anytime soon, and here's why. This is the official dog food review series by a nutritionist and someone who worked in the pet food industry for years. I am disappointed by the protein percent, and then when we look at the ingredients, get this. There's way too many, in my opinion, lower quality starchy ingredients like oats, rice, barley, potatoes. Why are we adding cheese to our dog food? And I get so frustrated with marketing claims like this, like added probiotics when these so-called probiotics are added so far down in the ingredient deck after salt. And if you follow me for any length of time, we know that anything listed after salt, these probiotics, the carrots, the duck, the lamb, are less than 1% of the total bag of food, making this claim, in my opinion, completely misleading. Also, they appear to be made with feed grade foods, which is something I wouldn't feed my dogs. And they use a ton of vitamin synthetics, which again, is not something I prefer. Tag the brand below that I should review next and follow along for tomorrow's dog food review.